Hi, I'm Tracy Sinjin. This is Balana Hersog. <laughs> I can never say your name right. Give it to us properly, because I, I, I already hacked your name in the first uh, two minutes. It's Balana Herzog. Balana. Okay, so yeah. Balana. You won yesterday. You had a tough match. Congratulations. Thank Tell you. us a little bit about the match. Um, actually, yeah, uh, it was a pretty good match. Uh, we played kind of late, so it, it became like pretty cold and windy a little bit at the beginning, but... Um, I, w I was um, like really like concentrated through the whole match, and uh, I was just feeling much better at the end. Um, she had a, she had a five three and a set point, so so that was that was kind of close. <laughs> but uh, I managed to fight through the first set, and, and was just getting better and better in the second. And what do you try to focus on when you're down like a set point, and you know at those times in the match, what do you focus on mostly? Actually, I'm just uh, trying to go through the whole match, uh, just to go point by point and shot by shot. Because if you're just trying to think about the score, then it becomes like pretty complicated, and you're just you're just like fooling yourself with the, with the score. And you should just go point by point, and that's it. And you've had a good year so far. I I, I like I like to think it's actually do a lot because you got a haircut. You know, you you had some good results this year. Um, you're already 52 in the world. Yeah. Uh, you got to the finals of Acapulco, your first WTA final, which was awesome. And then you also won your first uh, doubles title there. So that was a good tournament. What is it about Acapulco that's great? Besides, obviously, that it's like tropical and awesome. Yeah, um, yeah, it's been a great year so far. And um, Acapulco is just great. Everybody is feeling great there. It's kind of a, like like a vacation place so it's like really really relaxed and the, the weather is great uh, the sea is warm and you're going like there every morning you just you just take a bath and that's it and oh you um, took a bath yeah that, like, that's good uh, yeah every morning because we had the matches in the afternoon once or, a day only or like yeah if i had a match i had just <laughs> one in the morning i was i wasn't there like for five hours in the water and then i couldn't move on the right. court <laughs> you don't want to have water waterlogged legs no and uh, yeah, because the matches were in the afternoon, so everything was uh, really relaxed, and uh, there were a lot of spectators. So I really enjoyed it. That's good. And so uh, I was reading your your profile uh, on Wikipedia. There's. Did you know you had a Wikipedia profile? Uh, no. What does it say? <laughs> it says that you like snowboarding, basketball, and surfing. Yeah, yeah. I, I love snowboarding, but uh, I didn't have time to do it last year and this year so I'm I'm really disappointed uh, and I heard it just was like 30 centimeters of snow yesterday at home and oh wow I'm really disappointed about that so do you did you watch the winter olympics did you watch the snowboarding at all uh no I didn't get to watch it but uh I, I was just following our um Slovenians in uh, in skiing and stuff and uh, they did really great I'm I'm proud to be Slovenian <laughs> that's very cool and basketball who's your favorite basketball player uh, once I went to watch uh, Miami Heat and I was just like so shocked with the with the size and with the with the game of uh, of Shaquille O'Neal and yeah. I was just like oh he has my a God, little bit of he's, power yeah <laughs> he's huge and uh, I really enjoyed watching them and like he's pretty cool I think and and he likes to call himself Superman so yeah. if you if you if you started to do well and as even even better than you are now would you have a Superman, Superwoman tattoo? <laughs> no, I would. That's for sure. I, but I would want to have another tattoo or something like that. We'll you would have a tattoo? Yeah. I think what, would I would. You, what would you get? Uh, I don't know. If I would have a, a good idea about it, then I would do it. But if I would have just like some crappy ideas, then probably I wouldn't do it. Well, I hope you wouldn't have any crappy ideas. <laughs> no, because I wouldn't like it probably in a couple <laughs> of months. I would be like, oh God, why did I do this? So, um... E. Lecky asks, what, what, is your best, what do you like best about your Wilson racket, and which one do you use? I'm using the Blade 98. Um, I've been using it for a year and a half now, and uh, it's, it's really great. It's giving me everything I was looking for. I feel great on all the shots, um, the weight and everything. I'm not changing any of the, of the things on the racket, so I just play with the original one, and... Um, Really feels great on all the shots because um, I'm playing different. I'm playing a lot of volleys, um, slice, and it's just uh, been great with it so far. I think it's the best record. And what do you enjoy about you know singles and doubles? Which one do you enjoy more? Do you or do you like it for different reasons? Um, I mean, I like both. It's um, 
but I, I prefer singles though. Um, it's uh, it's a lot of fun to play doubles, um, and especially if you have a good partner and you have fun on the court, and it's it's really great. Um, I'm, but I'm, I think I'm more of a singles person because uh, I just like to do everything alone on the court, and uh, then you're responsible for the good things and for the bad things. You can't blame on anything else, and you're just there for everything. It's just you, yeah. yeah. And on Twitter, somebody asked, "Who got you into tennis?" Uh, actually, there was an ad in the in the newspaper that the new club was uh, was opening in uh, like really close to my place, and uh, my parents just just took me there, and I was like three and a half years old because they wow. just wanted to take me there, yeah, just to have friends, to have fun, and just to fill the the time. And uh, I got there, and the the guy who was responsible of the club he just said come on wouldn't you wait a little bit because i was like really small i was always the smallest kid ever you were like, small yeah yeah okay. i was really small Paul, <laughs> she she's six feet tall now just right at least the yeah. question from twitter was what string tension do you use um 25 24 kilos um that's my normal tension but um i just I just go to the tournaments and just try the balls, the court, the the air, and it depends. Like if I need a little bit tighter or looser, that's that just depends on the tournament. And then a question from Facebook was, who is your favorite player growing up? Who was my favorite player, or who is? Or who is? Or who was uh, growing up? I guess when you were younger. I guess they're assuming. Um, even though you're was, very young still. Um, I it was always Roger, like. His his shots are perfect. He's moving and everything is like so perfect on the court. And when you watch him, it's like everything seems very easy and just so natural. And I just really admire him. And so you're one of our up and coming rising stars. And so is one of your friends, Petra Martic. And I I think I didn't say her last name right either. <laughs> it's okay. I know. Okay. It, I'm American and I have a bad accent. I don't. I'm not sure where I'm from either. So so. Um, basically, uh, just tell us a little bit about her and, you know, give us some inside scoop. Uh, okay. The details? <laughs> yeah, give um. us dirty details. No. <laughs> Not dirty details, because we don't want it to go yeah. bad. Yeah. So, uh, we've been practi practicing together with Petra for uh, more than a year now. It's a year and a half. Uh, we, had, we have the same coach, we have the same team, and, um... It's really been great so far. She's just one day older than I am, and she's so she's always, old. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. she's always saying I'm more mature. I'm I have more experience because she's one day I'm older, old <laughs> <laughs> which tends to happen. Yeah, I mean that that life experience of that one day. Yeah, can you? Imagine? I mean, can you yeah. imagine? She has just a different level of maturity than you could yeah, ever exactly. have or ever imagine. Exactly. Right? <laughs> no, it's been, the practice with her it was great so far. We're having a lot of fun and um, we, we've been playing doubles together too and that was fun too. And uh, we just get along really good. And I think that's what matters at the end of the day, that you just have fun and you get along well. Do you think it's it's good to have, you know, another person the age, your, your age on the road with you that you can kind of, you know, talk to and, 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 and have the same experiences a little bit? Yeah, I think it's pretty important and that you have somebody who is like, because we have like pretty much the same ranking and everything and uh, there's always one pulling the other one and it helps a lot, I think. It's, it's pushes much, you too. Yeah, it pushes you like, and you can practice with her and like, we can talk about anything, so it's a lot of fun. And then, so, one question you got here is, what do you think your biggest challenge will be in your next round match? Uh, I don't know, actually, it's going to be the first time I'm, I'm playing uh, Marion, so it's going to be... Marion Bartoli, yeah. yeah. it's going to be a whole new uh, experience. So, um, I'll just have to try out, like, the first couple of games, I'm going to have to get to know her, but uh, I've been, like, we've been talking with the coach about her, so I'm just going to have to do my best tomorrow and uh, try not to play her game and just try to force force my kind of game. And uh, they're saying, Golovina is saying, you should get a Twitter, Polana. Uh Actually, I think I have a profile on Twitter, but uh, I'm never using Inactive? It. Yeah, it's inactive, totally inactive. <laughs> but you're, you're a big... Blackberry messenger I'm person, a, huh? Yeah, yeah, I am. So I'm her pin is, guys... No, no, just First, no. you must send a picture to Wilson of exactly, you. Yeah. And, and then I'll screen. The and then I'll decide whether or not 
you can get her pin number. <laughs> exactly. Does that sound <laughs> That's, acceptable? Yeah. Okay. I hope we have the same taste. I hope. I hope we do too. <laughs> what, who, who, who's a good-looking guy? Who do you think, like celebrity-wise? Um, what's your type? Um. Let's see. Um. And when I was little, I was really in love with Tom Cruise. <laughs> Tom Cruise. He's very short. <laughs> yeah, I don't think so. That's so. That's, no, he'd that's be not like gonna work down out <laughs> to kind of an. I could be on a my bad area <laughs> for you. <laughs> he would he would be not at the right level, let's say. Uh, but I maybe think, the right level for him, but not. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I I mean I think George Clooney is pretty cool. Uh, so you like the older guys? You're going plus. <laughs> you're going like plus twenty five. Okay, yeah. Plus, plus thirty. Yeah, come on. They're there's you smarter want, probably. You want them seasoned. <laughs> is that how you like your I steaks want, as well? Yeah, I want them baked. <laughs> <laughs> seasoned and baked. Okay. <laughs> Wow. And experience. And ex okay. Season baked and experience. I did exactly. I'm Those not sure are... if we're talking about cooking or or, <laughs> or guys. guys. I'm really I'm really confused now. Yeah. Okay, so we're gonna end it with we came up with this great idea. Yeah, I think and they should maybe decide. <laughs> I think that okay, we what we want to do is we're gonna have a contest on how much we can fit in our mouth. I I said I have a bigger mouth that which she is probably definitely true. does. You can hear that. She she has a pretty big mouth too, so we want to see how much. Let, well, we're choosing bread, goldfish, or or grapes. So should we just go for the? I think we should just go for the bread. Yeah, let's go for the. Okay, so who do you think can get more pieces of bread <laughs> in their mouth? I'm, I can't believe we're doing this. I can't believe we're doing this too. This is how we that kick was off her Twitter. Idea. Don't don't blame this all on me. I started with grapes and somehow it went up <laughs> yeah, to bread. Come on, it's, it's I don't need the carbs. I'm trying to lose weight. Go ahead. All right, you ready? You're the first. No, no, no. We together. go one, one, one. So it goes one, one. Oh my god. Okay. I don't know how to. <laughs> <laughs> you don't know how to put it in your mouth. Either. So you know how to eat. Here. And I just dropped a piece. All right, ready? Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, guys. I'm crying. You're awesome. <laughs> You're awesome.